Hi guys, I'm Tracy Smith, member of Highland Car Club, and I've been asked to answer a few questions, being a woman in motorsport. Uh, I'm not sure if there's anybody that likes to see themselves in a video, let alone hear themselves, um, especially being an Indonesian, but here goes. I'll cringe later when I have to watch it back. Okay, so the first question uh, I was asked um, was, how long have you been involved in motorsport and what got you into it? Um, Highland Car Club has been a part of my family for as long as I can remember. Um, my dad used to take part in club events and has competed in the snowman in the 70s. Um, my uncle Ormond was a competitor as well. Um, he was also the secretary of the club and uh, the clerk of the course of the snowman. Um, again, that was in the 70s as well. Uh, my youngest memory of Highland Car Club was attending the Christmas party at the Mercury Motor Inn uh, in the early 80s. Um, latterly, Dad took part in the Croftera Pandemonia, uh, which which I tagged along for. Um, later on that year, um, it was really only uh, six weeks after uh, the Croftera, the, um, the AGM um, was. So I went along to that and um, was voted onto the committee. Uh, and that was in 2015. So I guess you could say I've been involved in motorsport since then. Um, I don't suppose attending the Highland Car Club Christmas party at the age of five or six and getting the most enormous stuffed monkey from Santa um, uh, counts. So, um, okay. So, uh, question two. Um, what role have you in motorsport? Um, in 2016, I was nominated to become club secretary and I haven't really looked back since. Um, I started competing in club events, doing auto tests and road nav navigational events, uh, both behind the wheel and, and the map. And uh, I won the ENC Smith Club Championship trophy, which is here. Um, I can't even remember when I when I won it. Um, 2018 and in 2019. Um, this was uh, extra extra special for me, really, winning my dad's trophy that he donated to the club many moons ago. Um, when you join the car club, it's it's inevitable that you get involved in the snowman one way or another. Um, initially, I was involved in the setup of stages as well as marshalling on them. Um, there's also a small team of us that, that go to other events in the SRC and uh, we marshal them also. Um, I've also been fortunate to marshal further afield um, in Isle of Man and at Rally GB at Wales. Um, I run the odd road rally, um, but because I'm only a novice navigator myself, I always have to get help with the setting up of the expert navigation. It makes no sense to me. Um, so I need to get someone a bit more cleverer to uh, to set the expert navigation. Um, I became the event secretary of the Snowman in uh, 2018, and it's been fantastic. Uh, it's been a lot of hard work. It takes over your life, really, for a, a few months of the year. But I absolutely love it. Um, I'm, I'm privileged that Fiona Mono, Fiona Moyer and Andy Jordan have put their faith in me to have these responsibilities so early in my motorsport career. Um, have you any special moments from the snowman that you would like to share with us? Mm, well, I'm sure when you're competing, there's a lot more special memories made when you're when you're going through the woods at, at speed in the rally, but and not really up to your eyeballs and paperwork. But um, as I said before, um, I love it. And at the end of the rally, when you're sitting back, absolutely exhausted and reflecting on what's just happened, um, there's a massive sense of achievement to be part of something that is just truly great. Uh, the team is fantastic to work with and there's years and years of knowledge there um, and although I don't really have a specific special moment, just being part of it um, is special for me. If you could sit in the passenger seat and do a snowman rally with anyone, who would it be? Um, I would do the snowman rally with my dad, if I could. Uh, he last competed in the snowman in the 70s in a Hillman imp. Um, he still has a has an imp, uh, but it's not quite rally prepared to compete these days. Um, 
and we would have to do better than when we did a road rally together a few years ago. Um, I got monumentally lost, and Dad got more and more pissed off as as it was getting closer to midnight. So uh, we called it a day on the rally and didn't get a finish. But you know that's that's how you make memories, and uh, it was a great night regardless of of the result that we that we had. Um, what's your motorsport ambition? Well, that's quite a hard question actually. Um, as I think I've done pretty well to do what I've I've done and achieved in the last six years. Uh, I would like to get my time in Marshall's ticket and I would like to marshal abroad at another WRC event. But to be honest, I'm more than happy um, to have been given the opportunity to do what I already do. Um, maybe one day I, w I could sit in a silly seat for the snowman, but, but not yet. I'm still enjoying organising it. <laughs>